Hey guys, welcome to the video. Today we're going to be changing the front brake pads of Toyota Prius 2004. Let's go. First thing to do is to crack each lug nut loose with a breaker bar. Then raise the car up with a jack. Make sure to raise the car enough that the jack stand can fit under the car. Then place the jack stand under the car so it will connect to a thick piece of metal frame. Do not place it under the floorboard. Now lower the car onto the jack stand and do the same to the other side. Completely remove all lug nuts from the wheel. And remove the wheel. Then. Once the wheel is removed, slide the wheel under the car for extra protection. Get into the car and turn the steering wheel to give you more access to the brake caliper. Remove one brake caliper bolt. Then open the caliper up like a clamshell. And remove the brake pads. With a breaker bar, remove both brake caliper bracket bolts. Then, once the entire brake caliper and bracket is removed, hang the brake caliper in such a way that it does not dangle from the brake line at all. Should be using the axe. I don't have a, I don't have a hammer. Okay. Get a large hammer to remove the brake rotor. It's like rust welded to the hub. Wow. Use a metal wire brush to remove as much rust as possible from the hub. Then spray down the hub with brake clean. And make sure to have a bucket or paper towel below the hub to catch all the brake clean. Take the new rotor and spray both sides of it with a brake clean to remove all the grease from shipping. Then place the rotor on the hub and secure it with one lug nut. Add some medium strength thread locker to both of the brake caliper bracket bolts and reinstall the brake caliper bracket. Then, on this specific car, torque down the bolts to 80 foot-pounds. Take a paper towel, spray a bit of brake clean on it, and clean the metal piston without touching the rubber seal. Then get one of the old brake pads, place it against the piston, and get your piston compressor tool, and turn it until it gets very hard to turn. Then remove the tool and the old brake pad. Get your new brake hardware and place it in the same orientation as the old brake hardware. Get your copper anti-seize and add it to the brake hardware. And to the back of the brake pads. Then, slide your brake pads into the slot with the brake hardware. Close the brake caliper and tighten the bolts. The caliper bolts on this car get tightened down to 25 foot-pounds. Then place the wheel back on the hub. And hand tighten all the bolts.
then repeat this entire process for the other side. Then raise the car with the jack and remove the jack stand. Then do the same for the other side and lower the car to the ground. Torque the lug nuts down in a star pattern. On this car, the lug nuts get torqued down to 76 foot-pounds. Then, get in the car, start it up, and pump the brakes until it gets harder to do so. Do not worry, the brakes won't have any feel at the beginning, that's supposed to happen. And now, you've completely changed the brakes. Congratulations, you are done.